Autumn is here and Gede is back to her channel and today I want to talk about office outfit. I will be using the same key elements, key clothing pieces, a white button down, a pencil skirt in order to create different look. Different because together with you we're gonna create an outfit which is crisp, sophisticated yet modern and relaxed. I'll give you some tips and ideas in order to make your preparation for the office a little bit easier. So if you would like to know how, what and why, just keep on watching. We'll be starting off with a simple white button down, which in this case is a little bit oversized. When I'm matching a white button down and a pencil skirt, I want to avoid looking boring and too classic. I like to unbutton my shirt and then I like rolling up the sleeves. I will just, you know, play around and fold the fabric in this way that it feels secure, but at the same time it has this crisp line right here. So just bringing the fabric up, then making it neat and tidy and then rolling up it once again. And in this way I just make this look more relaxed and modern. Now with the, uh, with the bottom I think that I will just, I can tuck this in and then crisscross this part and then tuck that in as well. In this way I get uh, a little bit more fitted shirt look on my waist and then I have this part hanging out that I can just tuck in that small uh, additional fabric and make it look more neat and cool. Et voila! Now moving on with the skirt. As you can tell, if I'm wearing the skirt uh, around my knee area, it looks quite off because I think that it just makes my outfit look outdated, boring. Also, I believe what is tricky about knee area length that if you are wearing a button down, you are creating this proportion of one to one, which just basically cuts off your body into two halves that are equal and it's just not flattering perception for our eyes. In my opinion, there are three length options that looks modern and uh, might elevate your classic button-down pencil skirt look, which is either very short or mid-length that hits uh, around your calf area or maxi one that hits around your ankle or a little bit higher. So if I'm lengthening my skirt, I create a combination of outfit that has one third for my top piece and then two thirds for my bottom piece. Et voila! This is the most appealing proportion. If you would like to hear more about proportion of furs, please check out my older videos because I elaborate on this topic so much. The next thing on the checklist is our jewelry pieces. I love my jewelry pieces to complement my look and if I'm matching, you know, oversized pieces, I love having something very dainty and classy just to keep that look very chic. Annalisa Jewelry is the brand that I usually shop for my jewelry pieces. I believe that they have this perfect combination of classy yet modern and dainty pieces. So for today I have chosen these beautiful small hoop earrings and a pearl necklace which is very very delicate. This necklace has an extension on it so I can choose if I want to make it sit a little bit higher or lower which is just you know a great option because we might prefer different lengths with different tops. In my opinion jewelry pieces is a very easy way to create different moods, to create different feel to yourself and to your look. So if you would like to check sustainably crafted jewelry pieces Check out Annalisa Jewelry Pieces by clicking the link in the description box. Um, and watch. A good watch to make everything feel more professional and put together. So now we are moving on to the next step, which is shoes. 
which is very important part because I believe that with the right shoes uh, you can just make your outfit look very chic, modern and classy. So in the beginning I was wearing these shoes and uh, you know from the first line to my think that it's and it's actually nothing uh, wrong about these shoes but since it has this uh, satin finish very powdery uh, soft color I believe that they are more suitable for spring rather than autumn and by swapping these shoes into something like this I instantly in my opinion I instantly elevate my look and uh, I make a statement with my shoes however they are still on a very modern but yet classy note that's why I think that it just complements my outfits perfectly another thing that I believe shouldn't be overlooked is our pantyhose so in the beginning I was wearing these pantyhose that um, looks quite okay on my arm but as you can tell it is too dark color and if I take the shoes that I was wearing previously it's just you know too heavy for these shoes. I believe that in this transitioning weather when we still have some warmth and sunny days uh, I think that it is important to choose the pantyhose that are not too heavy, not too dense and also not too dark in comparison to our skin. And there is a great option that many brands have. Uh, I think it's called Bare Legs. And uh, those, you know, tights are very natural looking tights. So just make sure to pick the right one for you and for the weather that you are in. And also for the shoes that you are matching with. The next thing that I would like to touch on is the bag. So from the first glance, this bag is, you know, quite okay. And this is the bag that I was wearing probably maybe 10 years ago. I still own it. I love it, but you know, it's just not the right bag to be worn uh, during 2022. So why this bag doesn't work? Uh, I think that it has, you know, too many details like the hardware here and here, different fabric, zipper, uh, then all those details it just makes this outdated and also i think that it is just too big so instead of this bag i prefer having something more classy and structured i believe that this is a great combination to go with my shoes it does not really matches the color of my shoes but it just spices up the whole look I prefer to have this hardware in gold, but I don't see any, you know, problem with that and I think it just doesn't catch too much of attention because the first thing what you see is the color of it. This is my final look An outfit which is crisp, sophisticated, yet modern and relaxed. And that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you like this video and you will uh, implement some of my tricks and ideas the next time when you are getting ready for your office. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to check out Unleashed Jewelry by clicking the link in the description box. And see you next time very soon. Goodbye! Hey.